Hey, what's up everybody? It's Pablo1713. Hi and welcome in Anno 1800 Advanced Guide Gameplay, episode number 6. So, I <laughs> had to make some crazy math <laughs> to count everything. So, if I would find our... Where's our grievous guy? So, right now we got this trade road between those two islands and I had to count. And I counted that this guy, he needs 5 minutes to make whole trade road. Which means that in 5 minutes we can create 10 potatoes, because we are creating 1 potato every 30 seconds. So in 5 minutes we'll create 10, which means that we can take those 10 and transport them right here. Which also means that in 5 minutes this schnapp distillery will list all the potatoes that will be transported. Because he is converting also in 30 seconds every 1 piece of potato to 1 piece of schnapps. So which means that we have perfect ratio if there will be no delay because all the transported potatoes will be uh, converted to schnapps. And with the hoops, right now we are creating, we have three hoop farms, and they are producing one hoop every one minute and 30 seconds, which means that in, ten, in five minutes we'll create about 10 pieces of hoops. So those 10 pieces can be then converted to the beer. But right now I don't have any beer, and as I counted right here, one brewery is producing one beer every one minute. So in 5 minutes, he will need only 5 pieces of hoop. So if, if I'll place another brewery, that will mean that I will use all the 10 pieces that will be transported. That's crazy math. <laughs> I hope that you will follow this in some explain shit, but <laughs> we're gonna see. Okay, so first thing first, let's just take our ship. Where is he? Coordinates plotted. Where are you? Ah, right here. Because we got some gramophone character item so we can get rid of this item and right now we have 184 workers which means now we can start producing steel and finally we got this area working on full potential no building is waiting and everybody is working right here so that's perfect situation okay let's get rid of this item that's perfect and now we'll need to make this crazy thing with the beer. So first let's count the perfect ratio, which is really interesting because there are two ways that we can count this. Because first, let's check that we are producing one beer every one minute, one hoop every one minute and 30 seconds, one malt in 30 seconds, and one grain in one minute. Which means we will go to the right side of the chain. To have one piece of hoop, we'll need to place at least two that will mean that every 45 seconds there'll be one piece. And thanks to that it will be covered. But we'll have one and a half of hoop extra. Here, in one minute we'll create two malt. Which means that we can place another brewery. And thanks to that we'll use all the malt that, has, that is created. And if we place another hoop, we'll have three hoop farms. And they will produce three pieces of hoop. So two of them will be used by brewery. And with the grain, we're just gonna need two grain farms to cover this 30 second ratio. In one minute they will produce two pieces of grain and then in one minute this malt house will use them to create two pieces of malt. <laughs> okay, that's a little bit complicated, but thanks to that this will be the perfect ratio. We'll not uh, waste any item in this chain if we'll do something like this. But for me, it's kind of different because I don't have uh, required fertility right here. So it's hard for me to make the perfect ratio. So I have to count this An to my previous transporting ship that is transporting those hoops. So that was a little bit complicated, but let's find the perfect space for it. And huh, there are not a lot of space left actually, because I got plenty of different stuff everywhere. So maybe here, because I remember that grain needs really a lot of space. How much is it? It's 144 tiles. Yeah. So that's a lot, really a lot. But we don't have anything right here. Here we got limestone deposit, but we'll use it in the future. So we can try to make grain right here. We're just gonna need two grain farms, one malt house and two breweries. Okay, so let's try to do this. So let's first turn on this blueprint mode. 
and let's see if that will be enough space so I'll try to make like two so I'll try to design this somehow okay where is the road road is right here so we can just extend this road to the right side in the straight line and then from the center that's perfect and now we're gonna need two breweries so maybe I'll try to make like two of them right here and let's once again let's make the straight road okay so maybe it's always hard to make perfect space for it okay let's try it like this we're gonna need two breweries maybe I will try to make something like this this is my new design that I'm just <laughs> figuring it out so maybe something like this now next to it we're gonna make well, something like in T letter T all right and then we're gonna need one mouth house which will be in the center like this direction okay and then we're gonna need two green farms so one and two okay that's the idea and now let's check is that enough space to get 140 yes that's enough space so I can actually go a little bit to the left side just gonna cover this one so this area let's see we have to for sure move this trade union so probably this will be better place yeah, that would be much better place for it. A fire broke out. Okay, another fire. I hope that it's in Empire Strikes. Yeah, that's Empire Strikes. Woof. Because we don't have fire station in Return of Jedi. I just remember that. So that would be a good idea to create fire station in our city. But <laughs> let's go back maybe to the fire. Because those fires are spreading out really quickly. So let's fight this fire. Uh, let's clear all the information again. I should do this before the episode uh, every time. Uh, right now we got everything here covered. And this building can be surrounded like this. And then we can expand this to the right side. And use all the space as well. That's the idea. Actually I could even move a little bit far to the right. I could simply go to press. Okay, we got newspaper. Doesn't, uh, indeed Fire doesn't minus happen. five happiness. Oh, okay. Uncompromising journalism. Yeah, that's another problem. I want to make it super efficient, space efficient. Okay, I will destroy this and I will just redo this in the same design. So I'll just make it speed video. Oh, we got 2.4k from the Chinese girl. Chinese girl, Chinese lady. Okay, it looks like we're using all the space. That's much better, I think. And still covered. Yeah, that's much better design. That's perfect. Okay, let's just build this first. And can we do this? Yes, but we need to even expand more. So we're gonna need to have. Let's count this. I love the fire service. They help me a lot. <laughs> okay, that's great information for me. Fire has been vanquished. That's great. So that's twenty farmers. Um, here we need only workers. But we're gonna need seventy-five, seventy-five. So it's one fifty, one fifty, and twenty-five, one seventy-five. Wow! <laughs> so almost one hundred, actually ninety workers more and just 10 more farmers so that means 100 buildings more so I know that this is 80 because I got 8 buildings in a row and that's the maximum 10 so thanks to that I will know that I just need to upgrade 8 here plus 2 so that will be 100 extra and because I have to have 175 workers I will start upgrading some of those buildings. Okay, but they have to move in. Not much. So hope that all the hopes Oh, and we can advance. Yes, we can advance to artisans. 
Should we do this, actually? You reached a new milestone. Yeah, milestone. <laughs> Why not? They don't have beer, but we will produce it in a few seconds, in a few minutes, so don't worry. Okay, let's start building everything. A bold new expedition. And we got expedition. Yeah, this is something that I knew that will happen. Well, first I need to upgrade some houses. And we can start expedition. Okay, I just want to make sure that it will produce beer in the meantime. Need more farmers, they're moving in. And I just need some people, 75. Almost, almost, so we'll have minus one. But I will upgrade this one guy. And thanks to that, missing goods. Yeah, but you will have everything, no worries. In the meantime, we can go to the expedition menu. Let's just check our Action. ship. Ready for orders. Yeah, and let's create maybe... We're gonna need another ship. Okay, let's first send this flagship to expedition. From here to the so let's assign our ship. Of the world. It doesn't have a nice name. I want to change it. Sorry, guys. So let's make it Endor. <laughs> okay, because it was E, so why not? Okay. Six bonus to naval power and 25. So we're gonna need diplomacy. We got RAM. So that will be. Great chance and <laughs> goes to 100. They're like pirates, probably. So we need some faith, and the faith comes with the bread. So we got bread for diplomacy and hunting. Hunting is clay, as I remember. And we have nothing for diplomacy. Well, that's a bad luck. So maybe I will get rid of this rum. And I'll try to find anything that will give us diplomacy bonus. Or maybe we got some item. Medicine force, crafting, naval power, diplomacy plus ten. I can finally let go that pent up gas. He's full, common full. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna take common full out to our expedition. That's a great idea. Let's go. That's great. And we're gonna need to have another ship. Do we have cannons in our we got twenty two cannons? So we can actually build this, but we'll need 20, 100 workers, as I remember. So we can advance some buildings. We're in clover. I'm just gonna speed this up. And we got, whoa, we got festival. That's perfect. So we got some extra items from the festival. The people celebrate your leadership. That's very nice that they're happy and they're celebrating. Where's the parade? Show me the parade. Yeah, the parade is going on. So let's see the parade. That's my rum. <laughs> I took my rum. Okay. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Okay, interesting guy with a beer. Okay, so we, they are celebrating, so the happiness will be increased, more money will be generated, and we'll have some extra items. Construction time minus 30, construction cost minus 30, affects shipyards. Wow, that's productivity plus 300, workforce plus 15, happiness plus 10. That's perfect, <laughs> perfect. So we can try to build this frigate. Yes, <laughs> that's yeah, that's super awesome. That's awesome and great. So that means that we can use this. How much it will take? Twenty-seven minutes. So I can actually build some fleet. So I can use those two ships to have better fleet. That is perfect, and we got extra mission. I need out with me lowly trouble. Puzzle quest. Find and collect master. white animals. So you lose some white animals in our city? Okay. Everyday predators. White animals are hunting the farmer's hands. 
She begs you to catch them before they eat all her chickens. Okay, we'll try to catch them. I see those chickens, but no angry animals, like predators. Okay, that's a <laughs> big ass animal. Okay. Um, Alright, that's like werewolf or <laughs> wolf from Game of Thrones. That's really big. <laughs> Okay, okay, so we'll catch this. Okay, uh, where was I with those animals? The thrill of discovering new okay, we're somewhere on the edge because I like... They should be right here. Yeah, I got them. We'll gather and, toast your elf. and we got potatoes. Yes, that's great. We got fertility item. That's super helpful once again. Thank you, lady. And we can use this. And thanks to that, we'll not have to transport potatoes from this island to that island. And thanks to that, they will start to produce potatoes on their own. But right now, hmm. So we got two ships and we got three even. So if you have any ideas for the names for the ships, you can write them down in the comment section and I will use them. So thanks, but some good names from the, you know, from where. And thanks to that, we'll have funny names for those ships. So we got Grievous, we got Barnacle. Hmm, Barnacle. We can change this to DD8. <laughs> I know it's BB, but maybe DD. Why not D? DD8. Okay. So I'm waiting for the name for this ship. So you can write down in the section, comment section below your ideas for the names for those two ships Ship under attack. so we got 28 cannons and we can start to use them to attack this ship and we're gonna finish this episode I'll just try to kill him with my new ship you can run but you cannot hide whoa ships chop plane damage to sailing ships and damage from ships minus 15 that's perfect that was a good idea to attack that ship so we can try to even catch more pirates and get some more items, but I will do this in the next episode. So right now, boys and girls, thanks a lot for watching. I hope that you have some fun with me and I hope that we're gonna meet each other next time. So boys and girls, have a wonderful day and if you're watching this at night, then good night. See you next time. say